I finished another journal, and this one is a gift for my other niece. Stay tuned for the flip through. Hi, everybody. It's Julie, and I am here today with a flip through for a journal that I made for um, one of my nieces. And um, in case you're new to my channel, I do a crafty video every day, usually junk journaling, paper crafts, sometimes home decor, and crafty shopping hauls. So if those are your kind of thing, do stick around and don't forget to subscribe. So here is this journal that I made. It has, um, it's approximately nine by six. It has a five hole pamphlet stitch. It's a soft cover. I did make this fancy fluffy tassel. So it's got yarns and trims and some bling in it because of the theme, which is her. So there's several of these throughout. And, um, and then of course the sparkly cover. And I've sewn it together with another, uh, with wallpaper. And I did the flip up of the same sparkly paper. It is a soft cover. Um, but I think it's, it's really fun. So I did add throughout some of these, um, just fold outs that she'll be able to write on if she wants or draw or whatever. Um, create what you love. And then this beautiful picture says queen bee. These were stickers. The stickers that I've used throughout were, um, people give me stuff stickers. Okay. So one of my friends, her friends with getting rid of her scrapbooking stuff and has given her a bunch of stickers to give to me. And I use them throughout this journal. The papers are just a variety of papers from my stash. Okay, so here you open it up. We have a tuck pocket here with a couple of tags in it. And here's another one of those um, no papers and I've used it in the signature. We have several different copy papers that I've used throughout. And then you'll see I've used a lot of this uh, trim that it it's adhesive trim and I've used it throughout. This was one of the stickers from one of the sticker sheets. We have some graph paper here and a double sided tab. Some of the purple ribbon there. I did add flowers throughout. Another thing that was from the sticker sheets. Even these, these were from the sticker sheets. Added the word amazing and just put these really pretty like stained glass butterflies on the tags and you'll see those throughout. Okay, this is a 12 by 12 paper. I flipped it up, made a pocket and then you'll see over on this side it has a fold out okay so the pocket has a fold out on that side use the whole 12 by 12 sheet i did decorate some guest checks and have added them in here and um, here we have this was a leftover piece of ledger paper that i had in my pile over here so i put added that we've got shine and sparkle down here a couple a heart and a tag and I just added one of the little hats because that Christmas sticker sheet is still on my desk you are my sunshine the the my my sister used to sing this song you are my sunshine to all the kids and it's very special to our family so I did go ahead and add that in here and this one that says you crack me up and I just figure she can write something on there that's funny if she wants or add a picture I believe both of my nieces have those those cameras and will be able to um, add pictures if they want to. So I used a memory decks card here and here's some Rolodex cards and another tag. Here was a die cut um, edge that I had in my stash, some lace. I've added it on this side and um, I wanted it to be pretty from the side, and it, I think it did turn out pretty from the side as well. So here we have a computer paper flip up. 
So it's an eight and a half by 11. I've flipped it up and that gives you some decoration and color on both sides. There's another one of the stained glass type uh, um, butterflies. Got a couple of different trims here and a sticker for one from one of the sticker sheets. Here's a border from one of the borders and I just added it at the line of this purple copy paper and then added this trim to the other side so it gave decoration here. This gave decoration and the two of them gave, even though this copy paper is really kind of flim flimsy, um, these adding these to it have given it some strength. So here's another one of them and this one says brilliant. I added a couple of square stickers or a few of them and um, you know, she can write in there, write around it. She's very creative, so um, I'm sure she'll figure out things to do. Here's another one of those pages. Here is the back of one of the pockets. So it's another flip-up pocket. And this one has another one of those note papers. A guest check that says, so funny, with the tag on the top. And then I'm trying to start and use up some of my probably over like thousands of Project Life cards. I was I was a collector. So here's some more little ledger paper and I just added some of the, the stickers to that. Here's a new pocket that I just added. <laughs> just added this when, we'll just add a plain little tag in there just added that. There's two of them in here, so I'm probably going to have to add something to the other one. Um, here we have one of those double-sided tabs, some lace, and some bling. This bling also came, all of the stickers came in that um, people give me stuff. And um, we have the flower. We have this beautiful edge, and it reminds me of kite string. But it's, it's really pretty. I got that at Hobby Lobby. And here's a small flip out and a larger flip out. And then here we have a little um, paint chip that says Fairy Floss. And have her down here. It says Imagine. I've added Shine to a ticket. Here's another Project Life card and a guest check. Another trim on the side and trim on this side with the dragonfly. This one had butterflies on the pages. And I went ahead and I cut this page in half so there's a butterfly on two different ones. So it was an eight and a half by 11 paper pad, which is awesome to find an eight and a half by 11 paper pad. Friends, thick and thin, these stickers were also in that batch of, um, stickers that were given to me. Here's another memory decks card and I just put it in here. I think it's kind of fun that you can see it. And then we have large pockets here and this is coloring book and this is from uh, my mom's coloring book and so I'll make sure and I tell her that it's from Mimi's coloring book and she has a beautiful page that goes along with her theme from Mimi's coloring book. And then down at the bottom I've done the bobbles and a sequin butterfly. They hang out at the bottom. So there is a memory Dex card in this one. This eight and a half by eleven paper that was from a paper pad. I would I would watch and look for eight and a half by eleven paper pads. Um, we have another Project Life card, a guest check, just with the. Um, edge tab from the cover. Here we have another flip out page. Added a heart here from the hearts that I cut out from my Cricut and just have a yellow tag and left this blank and I like to write in diagonal when there's lines like this I like to use them for my writing. So a friends forever, another tag, lace, bling, and the double-sided bling. And since I had this, this and this, they're not going to be extra um, bulk because I already had the bulk. On this guest check, I just added a border. 
It's in here under this border tuck. Have this dream and wonder and dream. And um, I've attached it to be a tuck. So we've got the border here that's a tuck and this. And then I took this and it says butterfly. <laughs> it says butterfly wings. And I just added that beautiful stained glass butterfly sticker there. And here's another one of the beautiful stained glass glass butterflies and another one and this is a build a pocket so first I put down the bottom of the receipt I put down this border and then I had this border piece left and it was the perfect size and you can see there's a little bit of a gap in there but it's still gonna hold that in there so here we have another one of these and it says magic exists it's a little tuck pocket it's also a fold out we have the border on this one along with the trim border on the outside that makes this page substantial also have the flower up here here we've gone ahead and glued down the border and now we have a border tuck with a delight tag and a Sunday <laughs> um, project life card but it's pretty pink the butterfly and the orange dot and here we have a silver tag and a purple heart and the trim. And there's the other two butterflies. This is a flip-flop. So we have a flip-flop page there with the word delight. Bright and glittery sticker right here. The other side of the little ledger. Here we have a, um, one of those note papers folded in half. We do have a sticker behind. We have a guest check that I decorated. Decorated them with a tab and one of the stickers from one of the sticker sheets. Down here, I've added some of the tab across the top of this guest check and turned it into a little tuck pocket. Added one of the hearts. So here is one of our pocket flip outs. So you have your pocket here and it continues here. It's kind of small. But it did hold one of these tags and the this little paper piece that I had left over. Here I've taken this circle and I've turned it into a belly band. So And then put a guest check behind it. Here's the other side of that one of the note papers. Here we have a belly band. We've got squares, stickers over here. This belly band is holding a Project Life card a sparkle tag, and a card. Okay, so just, it matched. It was right here by the desk, so I put it in, okay? Then down here, we have another one of them, and everything starts with a dream, it says. And we have the beautiful flower, and it says lovely, and I love all these colors. They're bright and cheerful. And these copy papers were all from the Dollar Tree. So the purple one, the polka dot one, um, and then the scrapbook papers were from a paper pad from Michael's. It's all lightweight paper. Here's another one of the, I call them, they look like the bottom, like kite string, like kite tails. So it's kite tails, <laughs> but it's really pretty. It's all the colors that I used in this journal. Here's a couple of the star stickers. And on this side, we have one of the orange flowers. We have another one of the guest checks with the tab on top, circle. Here's another one of the hearts attached. And we just have a little tag here. Okay, and this is copy paper folded up, giving us a pocket. And I thought it was really cute. It's these little trees. And it just made me think of, of the, the little, these little guys, these little people. And um, so it says sparkle here, shine here. There's a tuck and this, and this can also go under and be held there. So we have a border and a trim and a large piece of ledger. Okay. So in this ledger is plain on the back. Here we have another flip up copy paper and it has a guest check and a Rolodex. We have the other side of the ledger paper. And here is another one of those note papers. They just looked really pretty and they fill up the space. 
Here's the other pocket flip, and it also has a flip flop under it. Okay, and then you can write on lines like this. Um, you can put pictures. We have graph paper with this beautiful sparkly sticker and the trim, and I love the way the it, you get to see this for a long time. It's an edge to this. It's an edge to this. It's an edge to this. So you get to see it for a long time. Okay. And I really like that. Then we have this here with the pink flower and some bling, the lace, and some more of that trim. This is adhesive trim. It was from Halloween from a couple years ago, and I have a lot of it. <laughs> trying to, so I'm trying to use up this one sheet of it, and I think I almost got, except what the stuff that was very Halloween. <laughs> um, here we have some more of the polka dot copy paper, and another side of the note paper, and then this is the last page, and we have uh, the trim, the beautiful trim. So there is still a lot of places for her to write or to draw or to put things and um, lots of still room to grow too. This one, even though it's it's bulky, it's not quite as um, bulky as I'm known to, to do. And it just has this beautiful lavender um, yarn as its tie. And there we go. So that is another journal finished. And again, this one is a gift. And I'm excited to give it to her and, and see what she thinks. And I hope you enjoyed this. I'm going to put the um, journal flip through playlist in the description box down below as well as other journals made with this character. Um, find something to celebrate every day and don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day and thanks for being here. Bye. Bye-bye.